What's up guys? Welcome to 2018. This has just dropped in. Uh, I've been meaning to get one of these for a little while now. Uh, this is my new basher. Um, I was going to get it a month or two ago, uh, but I thought I'd wait till Christmas out of the way, wait till the new year, uh, and why not start the new year with a new truck. A little bit different to what I usually, talk, um, usually mess about with. Obviously, as you know, if you've been on the channel a while, you know I quite like my Tamiya's. Um, recently, got a little uh, WL Toys um, to mess about with, cheap, cheap Chinese one. Um, pretty good fun. Yeah, loads of these about as you've seen. Um, but yeah, so this just dropped in from uh, Wheelspin. Brilliant service from Wheelspin. Uh, ordered it yesterday lunchtime. Arrived just before lunch today, so less than 24 hours, uh, and this is here, ready to open up. Um, it's a one eighth, one eighth truck. Uh, I've not got any one eighth scale uh, uh, trucks, and like I say, something I've been wanting to get hold of for a little while. Wasn't sure what I wanted. I had a choice of about four or five different things. Um, asked about, asked about on Facebook. Some of you that um, know me on Facebook might have seen my post um, with a poll for what to get. It was quite a unanimous win for uh, this one here. And so here is, I'll unbox it in a minute, just keep you in suspense for a while. Uh, just give you a quick update on what's going on in the channel uh, for 2018. Don't know what I'm gonna do for the whole year. I like to you know, make stuff up as I go along and think of things as I go along. Uh, a few things that are happening. First thing, as some of you might have seen on my last video with this, we, uh, we blew it up. So the motor's gone, the motor's completely seized now, as in, as you can see, wheels are completely locked, won't go around at all. I've got a new motor for coming for this, I've got a 35T crawler motor, going to put a new electronic speed controller in it, and I've got a high capacity battery coming. Going to lock the diffs up, got some new wheels and tyres coming for it, and we're going to give it a go, and see if we can get it doing a little bit of rock crawling, and a bit of trailing through some nice mud, um, bits and pieces like that, and hopefully some snow, if we get some snow soon. I'd like to get it through some snow. But yeah, so this first thing's gonna probably happen, we're gonna get this upgraded, um, and stuff's on the way for that. So waiting for that to come in. Something else I'm interested in doing, um, the Tamiya um, six-wheeler, you know, the Kong head, uh, well, the uh, Big Yellow, it's called Big Yellow I think, the six wheeler bus that's coming out I think this week or next week. I'm gonna get myself one of them and I've got, we've got some good plans for that. I don't wanna to say too much now. Uh, that's gonna be the next main project. That's gonna be happening probably next month. We've got a lot going on at the moment with the, a moving house. Um, so I've got a lot of changing, changing stuff around and getting bits and pieces sorted. Uh, so that'll be probably end of next month. I'm um, gonna get that thing going and that's gonna be quite an interesting project. Um, something to something to look forward to, a little bit different um, to probably what most people do with them. It's not something I've been interested in them six wheelers, not really, you know, not too keen on them as in I had a bit of a idea a couple of weeks ago to do and when that bus, when I saw a picture of that bus, it looks pretty cool. So I'm going to uh, get myself one of them and uh, do some quite drastic changes to it. Anyway, let's get this open. But yeah, so rest of 2018. Um, I'll do lots of bits and pieces, maybe lots of other builds, get some old Tamiya's back in. I've got a mad cap uh, that I'm in the middle of restoring at the moment, so I'll stick that on. Uh, that was my first RC car. It was a mad cap, that was about 1991. I got that. So that's being restored at the moment. Got this here that sat around for a while. It's a lunchbox um, pickup conversion that I'm doing at the moment. I've extended the wheelbase. It actually, I tried this the other day, it actually fits, look, fits on there. I'm not doing this, not where it's going, it's for a touring car chassis, but look quite good on there. If that went in the way, probably be quite cool. Um, yeah, so we've got this, might get round to finishing this at some point. Um, also, got rid of a few cars, getting rid of a few bits and pieces to make room for some new stock. But I think my next purchase will be that big yellow, the 6x6 six six, um, truck. This, however, is something I can take to the beach, take to the park, 
Might let my son have a go if he doesn't trash it. What is it? What is in the box? Dun, dun, dun. It is the Armour Outcasts 6S 2018 one. There it is. That is the new basher. I've not actually seen one of these um, properly. I've only seen YouTube videos on them. Uh, I've not seen them up close. So this is the first time I've opened this up. Um, so let's have a look. What's in it? So yeah, four wheel drive, brushless, um, up to 6S, between four and 6S. Does about 50, 60 mile an hour. This is the 2018 one, so a few upgrades, I don't know enough about them to go over them in detail. There is loads of stuff on, on YouTube and online about them. It's a beast. Looks like some spares, body posts, some XT90 uh, connectors. I probably need them because most of my stuff's Dean's connectors. Opinion. This is a beast. Comes almost ready to run. Just need to add your batteries. I've ordered a new 6S today. I've only got 4S. No, I've got a couple of 3S batteries, but they're not um, they're not man enough for this thing. There it is. Look at that monster. It's hard when you look at stuff. It's pretty hard when you look at stuff online to actually see the physical size of them. Um, Let's put it next to the uh, 112 scale WL toys. WL toys. There you go. That should give you an idea of the size of this thing. Pretty big. In fact, I've got a monster beat here as well. One tenth scale monster truck, apparently, from Tamiya. Monster beetle. One tenth. Apparently, this is a one eighth. I'm not going to put it on top of the monster beetle because it's got some good paint. There you go, look. There's a good size comparison for you between the Outcast and the monster beetle. Lovely. So yeah, so this is the new basher. This is what you're going to see a few videos of this coming up. Um, might take to the beach if we have a nice day. Um, if we get a bit of snow, we'll get out in the snow. From what I've seen, these are absolute animals. Let's have a look underneath. There we go. There it is. Looking forward to getting this thing out. Down the park or down the beach. Anyway, that's it from me. Just a quick video. I thought I'd do this quick unboxing for you so you could see it for the first time, the same as me. Um, keep an eye on the channel. Remember to, uh, if you're not a subscriber, remember to subscribe. If you are a subscriber, remember to hit that bell button next to the subscribe button. That'll keep you up to date um, when I upload stuff. Try and upload stuff at least once a week, sometimes more, sometimes less. Um, but yeah, thanks for the support. Um, and let's look forward to 2018. Get some more stuff done. Cheers.